Welcome to this edition of Ken's Garage. In this edition, we're going to talk about how to replace that damn rear wiper on your GMC SUV. So if you are somewhat mechanically inclined, you'll be able to do this yourself. You may need a wheel puller to pull the rear arm off of the vehicle, but once it's off, you'll be able to replace the wiper blade, which costs all of $10, fairly simply. So most GMC SUVs have the same configuration for the rear wiper blade. On this 2012 Suburban, it basically has the same configuration as my Acadia. So let's get started. First thing you're going to need to do is to remove this cover, peel it back to expose the bolt. I do not recommend you try and change the wiper blade while it is on the car because you're going to do what I did and basically attempt to pull this back so much that you're going to break the arm. Next thing you'll need to do to remove the arm is to jimmy out the washer hose which comes out like this there's a little fitting on it like that. Next you have to remove the bolt before that I typically recommend putting a little bit of lube on just to make it easier. This one uh, is fairly in good shape the GMC Suburban was a little tougher. Taking our half inch wrench Break the bolt. Okay, once the bolt is off, the arm itself is actually on a tapered fitting. You're most likely going to need a blade puller that they sell off of Amazon, or if you have a wheel puller like I have, you can use a wheel puller to basically put some tension on the arm and then pull it off. So here's what the wheel puller looks like when it's attached to the arm and the bolt itself. You just pull in some tension, tension on the puller itself, and once you get the wheel puller to release it from the tapered fitting, the arm should come off fairly easily. Once you have the arm off the car, it's fairly simple to replace the blade. Simply follow the instructions that are included in the package. And to put it back on, once you replace the blade, you'll have to take the tension up a little bit and jimmy it on, like so. And you can put the nut back on. So we tighten the nut just tight enough so that the arm pushes down back onto the spline. Not too tight. That looks about right. And then we'll reattach the hose. This is what it should look like. After the assembly is back on the car, and basically you just snap the cover back on, and you're done. So that's it for this edition of Ken's Garage. With any luck, you'll be able to replace that rear windshield wiper on your GMC SUV.